Can we talk state shapes for a second? Because Oklahoma is overwhelmingly the best state shape in world history. And the reason is the panhandle. That rectangle of plains makes Oklahoma look so good on a map. Yes, it's pretty flat, but it has mesas too, and sand dunes, and dinosaur tracks, and it also has art. Last year, Oklahoma Living Magazine named a teacher at Guymon High as the state's best art teacher. Meet Christy Patterson. This is my 21st year teaching art in the same high school I attended. It's not the same building. There, there's, it's a new building. Uh, I teach everything from beginning drawing to advanced placement art classes. And we have children in our classes who've come from all over the world. My, my goal as a, as a kid was I was going to join the Peace Corps and travel the world and uh, ended up meeting this guy, this boy. We married and, and moved to Guymon, and uh, I didn't have to go anywhere exotic and to meet all these amazing people. They moved to Guymon. Christy's the youngest in a third generation panhandle ranching family, and she found herself drawn to art early on. I just was driven to draw and paint and cut and write, and I had very supportive parents that just delighted in every ridiculous scribble or weird poem that I put together. It just launched me. And now it's something that if I'm not creating, whether it's sewing or directing a show or, or working on a, a, some kind of painting or drawing, I get very unbalanced. And I think that's true of a lot of creative people. Christy found her signature style while teaching collage to students using pages from old damaged dictionaries to draw on. The pictures that I am most recognized for now are old nostalgic looking drawings on antique dictionary. And so I was actually kind of tearing up a dictionary for my students then to use and paste in their books and draw on. And I just happened on a page that said hum hummingbird and it had a little tiny illustration of a hummingbird over in the corner. And so I just thought, well, I'll just draw my own little hummingbird on this page. It had just exploded for me. I'm selling artwork across the globe and I can't believe I'm sitting in my pajamas in the second story of my house, shipping things to Japan and Australia, all over the world. It still blows my mind. Few Oklahomans see the panhandle, so I asked Christy how she would depict it to someone who's never been. I'm a, I'm a farmer rancher daughter, and uh, I can tell you that a freshly plowed field and those kind of things just have a, have a, a beauty to me and a sentimentality to me. I think a lot of people, See the skies we have we're known for our sunsets the the thing i would do if what they you're asking i would do i would do an older person's work in hand and just have have that view because i think this area was built by a lot of hard-working pioneers and people today even even the people that are moving here from across the globe i think they're they're working hard people and are hard-working people <laughs> <laughs> it's the end of a long school day, I'm sorry. Check out Christy's Etsy page, Flying Shoes, or follow her on Instagram at Christy P A T T. To see more Gallery America online videos like this, remember to follow our Instagram account at OETA Gallery. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time, stay arty, Oklahoma.